Hi, my name is Norm Nadeau from Willington, Connecticut. And today, I'm going to show you how to go green with your car. Today, here we have a 1983 Mercedes diesel, non-thermo, and we put a hydrogen fuel cell on it, a hydrogen generator, a device that makes its own energy out of distilled water and vinegar, a small tank. The benefits of putting a hydrogen fuel cell on a car and making it a hydrogen hybrid, which this will be one of Connecticut's first hydrogen hybrid cars. The benefits are increased fuel economy substantially, it cleans up the motor, it smooths out the ride, okay, and zero emissions out the tailpipe, which means no greenhouse gases. We don't do anything to the diesel going into the engine, but the hydrogen being pumped into the engine cleans it all up. Thus you have what they call a clean burn. This car has 200,000 miles on it. I do drive it back and forth to work every day, 40 minutes one way. We have installed a fuel cell on this car exactly two weeks ago. We have never stopped driving the car for the past two weeks. I've always had this car running every single day. The tank, the one liter tank under the hood, only went down a half inch of distilled water and vinegar. And we went from 34 miles to the gallon to somewhere around 50 miles to the gallon. The particular kit that I put on this car can also be put on any other car, gas or diesel, or truck, gas or diesel. Let's take a look under the hood. Of course, right now we're under the shade of solar panels from the rain, but let's take a look under the hood. Okay, let's take a look under the hood. Here, the hydrogen fuel cell is mounted just below the alternator on the frame next to the fan to cool it when it heats up. We use vinegar and distilled water in a very small tank here, smaller than the windshield washer tank, mounted right here. We also have a, a collector for water so that water does, pure water doesn't go into the engine, just hydrogen gas. When the engine is turned on, when the voltage in the alternator goes up, the regulator goes on and the fuel cell is on, pumps hydrogen directly into the engine. The faster you go, the more hydrogen gets pumped into the engine. Actually, the smoother the engine gets. Uh, so this normally aspirated diesel engine sort of feels like it has a turbo on it with a fuel cell on it. Also, we don't have to go to hydrogen fueling stations to get hydrogen because we make it on board with a small tank of distilled water and vinegar. Very simple design. It's been around for years. It's been on fleet trucks with tractor trailers and buses. Finally, you and I can have one of these on our cars to improve our economy. So when gas does go to four or five dollars a gallon, we will keep driving by the gas stations with a concept like this. Well, folks, that's it for today. I think it's time for us to go for a ride in one of Connecticut's first hydrogen hybrid cars. Have a great day.